college football season again. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And I love the uh, tradition and uh, the community that comes out of it. And you know, in Walmart on Saturday, there were there was a guy wearing an Alabama shirt, a guy wearing a Clemson shirt, and they walked in the opposite directions of each other. And they saw each other. It's it's a pretty awesome time of year. And last year, the University of Tennessee. And you're off to the worst start in a generation. The only good news that came about the University of Tennessee came from an elementary school in Florida this week. For a little boy, uh, during their uh, college colors week, didn't have any merchandise from the University of Tennessee. So his teacher said, take this piece of paper and draw something and just we'll pin it to an orange shirt for you. And he did that. And he was really excited about it and was really happy with himself until he got to lunch. He was bullied by some kids. Well, when he got back from lunch, his teacher said, don't worry about what they've said to you. I've got a plan. And so she shared it strategically with some people in this photo of this little boy wearing this white piece of paper with UT written on it, went viral. And not long after that, the University of Tennessee made a print of that shirt, and now that shirt has already sold over 10,000, and the proceeds from that will go to an anti-bullying campaign and a scholarship program. To that little boy, in that moment, when he was picked on, when he was made fun of, his whole world came crashing down. And it's true, sometimes in life, people are going to make you cry, but the promise of God is so much greater. Faithfulness took just a small act and turned it into something huge that is going to impact thousands of other people. So this morning I remind you that in, in spite of the tears that other people may cause, God has something greater than you can begin to imagine planned in your life with just a little bit of faithfulness. Will you stand with me? Gracious God, we thank you for who you are and that it is in your very nature to do more than we can begin to imagine. Lord, we thank you that your wisdom is so much greater than ours, that your love is so much deeper than ours. And Lord, we ask that you give us more of it. Lord, help us to be wise like you. Help us to love like you. Help us to see the world through your eyes, to see each other as you see each of us. God, we ask that you open the eyes of our hearts. Lord, open our minds that we will receive your word. Open our hearts that it will be planted there. And when we open our mouths, may your love pour out. Lord, in this time together, we ask that you fill this place with your glory, that you that you meet each of us where we are, and that you strengthen us, Lord, that we will live a life for you. It's in Jesus' name we pray.